Hello, my name is Scott for SP Gaming. We're back here in TerraTech Tuesday, and this is my new tech. I have taken a bunch of the weapons off of this beast. Uh, yeah, we have only a few weapons left, and it's been repaired, ready to go. It does, oh yes, a decent amount of damage. So let's go take out some guys. I had gotten a note that my tech was under attack, but I'm not sure what's going on now. What I would like to do, and for some reason, the game wants to think my tech is faced in that direction. So yeah, that is a little bit annoying. So the arrow is going to be a little bit off, but uh, it's not going to be that much of an issue. Look at that tech has a new girder block up ahead. Elvis. Well, let's see what we can do against it. And there we go. Oh, not yet. There we go. Geocore girder block. Pick up the girder. Okay. Girders weigh less than a standard block, but also have less APs. So, is AP like attach points? Because, yeah, I see. Cannot attach anything to. Sorry about that. Well, <laughs> um, what I can do is I can grab a few wheels, possibly. Let's put some like right there. Grab the other wheel. I can throw it right about. Um, uh, right there. And what do we have over there? We have a diamond ram. We have another wheel. Hmm. All right, well, what I'm going to do is throw this up here. And yeah, all my weapons by default. This is annoying. The front of the cab should be whatever direction my cab itself is facing. Not whatever it might have been. All right, we got another kill you. Send our shots off in that direction. And there we go. <laughs> Come on. Alright, so... Yeah, he was completely destroyed. We got a, oh, a few weapons. Oh, nice. I think I have a spot right there for it. Now, I'm actually going to put this on the back. <laughs> oh yes, indeed. We are now powerful. We are maneuverable. One scoop claw, find the scoop tech. Crusher wheel. Okay. Is that off in that direction? Oh, what was over there? Not just stuff. It'd be nice to have better camera controls. Alright, we're heading in this direction. And yeah, I might have to rebuild this tech. And actually, over there is, I think the trader, yep, the trader's over there. Alright. 
Now, what do we got over here? We got... Flipstick. There are reports of any new tech with this new scoop available. Oh. There we go. And Geocorp, one scoop. Grab, grab the scoop. All right, so. Now, the question is, what does the scoop allow me to do exactly? Flipping enemies upside down. Oh, <laughs> interesting. All right, about that. Well, let's grab this block here. And then what I can do is I can put some weapons, of course. We're going to want to grab this and we need to rotate like that. I might have to tear this tech apart and rebuild it. All right, we have a couple of wheels. Do we need wheels? Nope, but we could definitely use that block. I'm actually going to grab this, throw it here. All right, now. What I'm going to do is go off in that direction. Where's this? Yep. Yeah. All right. No, we need. We want the. Crusher wheel. And... Okay. Um... Find the wheel tech. Battery pack. Find the battery tech. Where is that exactly? That is off in that direction. Let's go in that direction. And the killer KK. Oh wow. Come on, come on. Take out its cab. There we go. Nice. Wow, that's a lot of GSO tech. So what do we got here? We got... GSO 8. Oh? Wow. If we put that there. <laughs> Although it looks like our cab is damaged. Got some more eight barrel. Throw this stuff here. Now it's a pound cannon. 
All right, let's take a look at our... All right, so I'm gonna put this... that actually I could probably put it right there yep nice so I'm going to put that there so if I'm right those can sit behind regular weapons and fire over them now some some of these we'll throw them there throw that there anything else worth taking we'll grab that there we'll grab that there all right now after yep yeah. for some reason the tech thinks it's facing that way so, I have to pick this up, rotate it around, pick it up, rotate it around. Same thing with this, rotate it around. And this one up here, rotate it around. All right. And we got an enemy tech nearby. Pew behind. <laughs> there we go. Really? nothing much so I'm going to have to go in search of the battery tech off in this direction and ooh, that looks like actually before I do what I want to do is return back to base we have a little bit of a damaged tech I'm not going to bother picking up those pieces we're currently playing around with Geocore. All right, I'm gonna to need to go in this direction. And yeah, right now I really don't want to maneuver or rebuild this tech. All right, so we are going to want to get into the repair field. And right there, anything else into the repair field? There we go. All right, we have an enemy, the real redneck. Oh, that thing looks like a beast. So I'm going to want to make sure I have some backup room. All right. Um. Rotate the camera. There we go. Let's take it out. It got no chance. Oh, there we go. It still has weapons. It's going to be no more. There we go. So. It's another cannon. We have a variety of different weapons, so. All right. Oh, he has quite a decent supply of those. Not much else of interest, maybe. A, no, not really a drill. Hmm. A 
Although, with that said, we do have space for more weapons, so... Uh, no. There we go. And... Alright. Oh, did we lose a weapon? Well, we might as well just replace it. And I think we lost a weapon off the front. Hmm. Looks like that one's damaged. Do we have any more space for more weapons? Nope, we're good. All right. So, I want to head off in this direction. I call mine the big beast. All right, so the marker's off in that direction. Find the battery tech. Okay, um... Hmm. Let's go off in this direction. Battery ram. It's called battery ram. That means it's probably specialized to ram you. Oh dear. I really hate the camera. there oh they got crusher wheels Where are those and yet looks like we've lost some weapon or wheels no weapons all right um What I'm going to do is throw that there. And yeah, we'll throw that there. And now I'm going to throw the crusher wheel over here. is a scoop what is this okay that's the the battery great this battery has much higher capacity than basic GSO one well what I'm going to do I'm going to put that there and we're gonna fit the battery right in there now Drop this off, throw this here, put the ram back on just in case, and I'm going to, yep, we're going to grab another crusher wheel, like that. Yeah, what else do we got? We got a diamond ram, we got some more wheels, we got a few weapons. Let's just, all right, so looks like we're missing a weapon right here. And of course we have to rotate it. And I'm going to throw this weapon right here. And of course, oh, I see. 
So the crusher wheels have spots right on the top. That is interesting. Okay. They are also a bit wider. And... Nope, they're the same height. Well, they're not... The regular wheels are taller. But these are positioned so that they are flat to the ground. All right. Now, what do we got? Harvest Boss or Shock Plating? Off in this direction. And another thing is that... Do they actually... They... Oh, that's another thing. The Crusher Wheels don't really turn. Not as much of the regular wheels. So... Although for some reason, my wheels are going. Okay, never mind. That's right, okay. That makes a little bit more sense. Although it does feel a little bit weird. Anyway. We're heading in this direction in search of shock plating. And yet my tech is getting overloaded, which means it's of course slower. Oh dear. Enemy with shock plating over there. Is that a, hmm. Buff Spike. Oh, okay. He was in his building. And there we go. Broke him apart. Come on. There we go. Shock plate. Grab that plate. All right. One of these, if we put it to... These will protect the tech. Okay. So let's just put it like that. Like that. Well, apparently it didn't protect that tech very well. <laughs> Let's uh, throw that one there. And another one right there. Now they have some crusher wheels. Regular block. Which I'm going to put actually right. No. Oh, that's a silly. We'll put that there. And now. Oh, that's just crusher wheel, crusher wheel. We have one more thing on our mission log, which is to find Harvest Boss. Off in that direction. So, that is what we might just do. Oh, Chewie. Let's take him out. There we go. Got him. And a couple blocks, a couple wheels, a girder, a couple weapons. Oh, looks like we are lost. A weapon. Actually, I'm going to grab this from there. And rotate it. All right, about that. Hmm. 
Do I want any more blocks on this? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. We'll just uh, put one there, and we'll put the other one... The other one right here. We'll throw that there. Throw this right there. I'll grab the girder just because. All right, let's go find Harvest Boss. Although now might be a good opportunity to take a break. But we'll just see how challenging Harvest Boss is. Yeah, we're going slow over the sand. Although our other tech would be a lot more slow. <laughs> would not be able to handle the sand very well and there be harvest boss or maybe not now we're going into an area we have not been to before oh he's way off there oh wow all right well this might be the last thing I do this episode oh, this is rather interesting Now, Harvest Boss. What is the best way to handle this? Thinking going over in this direction. Meeting him kind of on even train. Alright, so Harvest Boss. Can we take a look at him? That's Harvest Boss ahead. Let's. He looks kind of stuck. Oh dear. There we go. And... Did we do it? GSO license upgrade. Grade 3. Congratulations, the GSO has upgraded the license to grade 3. The following blocks can now be purchased from the GSO trading station. Or constructed with the GSO fabricator. Uh, it doesn't even... Okay, how about that? Well, um... Looks like I've lost a few weapons. <laughs> um, we have... Fair Tech 2? Interesting. Alright. Well, whatever that is. <laughs> and, yeah, we, have, we got a lot of GSO stuff here. So that was... Harvest Boss. Alright. Um, let's... An invader is coming. Prepare yourself or flee. Well, um... Oh, I lost my scoop. All right, well, let's get out of here. You've been invaded. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. <laughs> Take the fabricator back to your solar generator. I don't have a solar generator up there. Oh, wow. Ah. Uh... Let's 
see if we can pick them off. Oh dear. Let's get in here. Kind of stuck. Um. Let's. Adjust ourselves so we can kind of shooting over his head. Thankfully, <laughs> we're kind of on un uneven ground where he's kind of at a disadvantage. He's very flat and wide, and although I am the same. Nope. We need to find a spot where yeah. Somewhere right about there. Take out his other wheel. It'll be a lot more difficult, easier to deal with. There we go. This is a combination of GSO and GeoCore. Okay. Looks like his wheel is dead. So he's not going to be able to maneuver. Or not. <laughs> oh, no, 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 no. <gasps> no. <laughs> oh, wow. Uh, no. Oh, this is not good. All right, well, at this point, I'm going to take a break here because, well, I can't do anything. I can't actually jump back over to my other tech over way across. I am a little bit surprised I got uh, transported here. So, yeah, that's going to end this episode of Terra Tech Tuesday where we got destroyed by Cyclone and then I'm stuck here having to buy new tech. Awesome. All right. Anyway, at this point, I'd like to say thank you for joining me for this episode of Terra Tech Tuesday. My name is Scott for SB Gaming and as always, have a good day.